morning guys it is Wednesday I have my grandma coming over to hang out with the girls for a little bit while I go do some grocery shopping I just need like some odds and ends like um, random stuff and I just want to be able to walk through and look and the last time I went to the grocery store with the girls I had my stepsister with me which is um, huge help and it's company as well but um, I had a man put his hands on my daughter and try and push her down in the cart because she was standing up and it put a I just will not take them with me anymore because I'm not going to risk their lives or anything of that sort. It terrified me. So, um, I am going to go alone now. So, I guess it's kind of cool to have some mom time. So, yeah, I'm going to go grocery shopping. I have to run some errands. And when I get back, I'll probably just show you like a food haul of what I got. You, um, I think you guys like those. I always like watching those. So, I'll go ahead and do that as well. Um, I am still fasted. I have not ate yet. It is... Um, 9.28 in the morning, and um, I still haven't ate yet. I'm really not that hungry, but I know that by um, 11 o'clock, whenever I'm out and about, I'm going to be starving, and then I'll want to stop and get something to eat somewhere, and I don't want to have to do that. So I'm going to um, make myself something real quick, probably eat a Perfect Bar, and then um, get ready to go. Alright guys, I'm going to go ahead and just have the um, original refrigerated protein bar, coconut peanut butter, um, perfect bar. And the macros are, see, I know my nails are falling off, um, 340 calories, 21 fat, 25 carbs, and 16 protein. So this should keep me full pretty much until my snack before dinner. So yeah, honestly, I guess I'm only having like three meals a day. I'm only going to have this bar, I'm eating a snack, and then I'll eat a huge dinner. But we're having chili cheese dogs for dinner, so that'll a lot for a lot of my calories. And we're going to a ball game tonight, and um, you got to have popcorn and a soda and candy. And I allot myself the soda. I know it's awful, guys. I know all the sugar is not good for you. I get it. I totally understand. But it's my guilty pleasure. I'm going to try this for you guys and then put it in a bag and keep it for whenever I'm not about. Guys, I'm going to throw my Aldi and get more of these. That's all there is to it. Oh my god. It's so good. Like, look at the thickness of that. Like, it tastes like a candy bar. It's so good. Alright. I'm going to throw it back in the fridge. And whenever I get ready to go. Also. This stuff. I'm going to buy today. In fact, let me put it on my list. Because this stuff is so so good. So good. What is up guys? We are back from the store. I have coffee in my veins and I have a hundred dollar bill worth of groceries right here I want to show you. Um, I was pretty excited. I kind of went in and just started throwing stuff in the cart. I didn't even like, I had no kids. I didn't want to think about like being on a schedule on a budget or anything I just wanted to get what I thought we needed and see what happened and guys I stayed within budget it was great so let's get started first things first um, I went ahead and got regular white bread because diet bread is disgusting guys it's cardboard it'll do what you want it to do but it does not taste very good it's not very satisfying so I went ahead and just got regular white bread um, family will go through this um, pretty quickly so I'll have to go get more um, then we're having chili cheese hot dogs chili dogs um, chili cheese dogs and fries tonight so I did go ahead and get the 80 calorie buns um, just because we don't it's a one-time thing we don't use it all the time so the bread won't get too stale um, and the buns aren't as bad as the bread is so I went ahead and got that um, snacks I got this healthy pops 100 they're single um, bags there's 10 of them 
I think I paid like two something or three dollars a box and it comes with a free red box um, rental and I went ahead and got the um, buttered one and the kettled corn because the girls love popcorn um, so I thought that'd be kind of cool for them to have their own since they're instead of popping a big bag they each can have their own little bag and then I can also enjoy them as well um, and then I got these um, Paw Patrol graham cracker snacks. I thought maybe that would entice them to eat these graham crackers more because they have a hard time getting, like, they won't eat. They want chase. They want chase. Graham crackers are messy by themselves, but um, them being in Paw Patrol shapes obviously are going to get the kids to eat them, so I thought that was pretty cool. And they're, air, let's see, there's 12 in a pack, so that was pretty good. And then I went ahead, for me, grabbed the, um, I've never had these, the Triscuit Thin Crisps. They looked pretty good, and the macros on them are really decent. You can have 15 crackers for 21 carbs, and I thought that was pretty nice. So I got those, and then obviously the Rosemary Olive Oil. If you guys haven't had these, it's delicious. I could eat a whole box of these. They're dangerous. Um, the macros are not as good. They are still 20 carbs for 6 crackers, which isn't bad whenever you want a snack. So I mix these two things. We're going to jump here for a second. I mix these two things with my um, garlic and herb, garlic and herb laughing cow cheeses. So I got two of those to go with those crackers. Moving on to um, vegetables, I got some broccoli um, to cut up and roast, bananas because I already had oranges from Aldi and apples. Um, the the organic ones were um, as much as the regular bag of them so I went ahead and got the organic ones and there was more in the bag and they looked better so um, always keep an eye out for that guys it was a three pound bag even so I got those Pro um, produce I got or um, I guess protein source I got some tofu today um, they were out I always get this one just the firm one um, but I went ahead and they were out so I went ahead and grabbed the extra firm I'll try and see if there's a difference in them um, I don't know that last time I could tell but um, I love tofu. Tofu is like a go-to in our house. It's so good. And then I got some stir fry for the tofu that we got. And then I got some french fries tonight for our chili cheese french fries. And then riced cauliflower, guys. This is so good mixed in with rice. It like adds more volume to your food. It's so good. And then I got some of this oven roasted turkey breast. Um, lunch meat by Oscar Mayer. I don't usually spend this much money on it, but it looked good and I was like, you know, if I'm going to eat good lunch meat, then I want it to taste good, I'm going to go get it. So, um, I also grabbed some of these little olives to go um, for the girls as snacks for lunch. So, I thought that'd be, they would like that. Um, odds and ends, I got some wipes. Um, deep moisture replenishing shampoo, just something, I don't know. I don't even, I usually, I don't really care. I just grab Mommy, whatever. we made the foot. Yeah. This foot. Good job. And then I grabbed this candle because um, I've burned all of my candles that I've gotten for Christmas. And I grabbed some of this Lemmy Shine um, dry rinse. I needed rinse aid for my um, dishwasher. As well as I, need, I always clean it out. I try and clean it as often as I can. Um, so I went ahead and grabbed some of this. I've heard good things about it. So I grabbed um, some cleaner and then little trash bags for um, the bathroom and the girls' diaper pail. And then I also got the girls have been. Uh, I'm using baby towels still, so and they're that, just that first thing is my the quickest charm. Yes, um, the girls have been using baby towels still, and last night we were like, "This is not cutting it because um, their bodies are just not. It's not getting all the water off because the towels are too little." So we went ahead and got them um, big big girl towels. Um, Grace Lee's obsessed with Frozen, obviously, so I got her Frozen, and Moana is like Charlie's obsession right now so i got her um pua and then tonight we're going to um my brother-in-law's basketball game which i yeah he's like in high school freshman high yeah. school got these for the girls for being good all day so that they can eat this while we're at the game because i you know we promise them snacks whenever we go to the game because they're so good so yes. um i got him some of those and then pro, uh dairy i got yogurt for my husband and i and then I got Go-Gurts, obviously frozen. Um, you know, they really do like these flavors. Some frozen um, Go-Gurts. And then I talked about the Laughing Cow Cheese, which is really good on omelets and bagels. And I love this stuff. This is so good. Um, I got some Fiesta Blend cheese and some fat-free cottage cheese. And then I got 
I have never been able to find stir fry or fried rice seasoning anywhere, guys, anywhere. And I actually took time to look in the Oriental um, section at Walmart today, and I found these two. They were $1.24 a piece, which is a little bit steep for seasoning for me, but I don't really care because I love making this on my own. Like, I love doing tofu stir fry and stuff. So, I'm really excited to try the stir fry with my stir fry bag of vegetables and cauliflower fried rice with the fried rice seasoning. It's going to be so good. And then I got this miso broth soup and I'm going to make um, ramen noodles with it and I think that would be so good for dinner ones. I, I've been on a salad kick lately so I got some poppy seed dressing. If you haven't had the skinny girl poppy seed dressing, guys, fat free, sugar free, it's so good. Yeah, there's like no calories to it. Three grams of carbs per two tablespoons, and that's all you need. Like, it's so good. And then I found this, and I didn't even look at the macros on it. I went ahead and just got it because if, you, if you've ever had the Subway Chipotle dressing, oh, it's so good, guys. So I went ahead and grabbed some of this. It is pretty high in fat, but carbs are low, so um, try some of this out. And then um, I got some butter spray. I'm not really picky on that because it's all just nothing. There's nothing to it. Um, I did grab some sparkling water, which I really want one of these right now. Actually, this looks so good. I got some sparkling water. Um, I, I don't know if I talked about this yet or not. Um, I got, we got salted caramel mocha creamer this month, this week. I don't know how long it'll take me to go through it. The last mocha one I got, I did not like at all. And I really like the international delight creamers. I think anyways, I think it's the ones I like. Guys, I don't know. I'm not usually a creamer drinker. The peppermint mocha is what got me hooked. So, anyways, I'm trying this out. Um, and then I got some Sunny D for the girls. I was going to buy the individual little, um, like, drinks. But there were six, six of them for, like, four bucks. And I was like, ah, I don't know if I'm going to do that. I'm going to go ahead and get a big old jug of it. 14 grams of carbs per serving, which is really decent. So, I actually can have some of this. Um, I got some caramel syrup for coffees and um i mean how good would this be together i mean come on that looks delicious um so yeah i'm going to use this for coffees and sundays and stuff and then the girls juices and then i went ahead and picked up some of these i've had these before these are really good um they're 99 cents or 98 cents a piece there's four in a pack um you just drink them drink it with like milk it's a straw and it makes your milk taste like that and i think the girls will really enjoy that so yeah, I went ahead and got that, and that's it, guys. That's all. I hope you enjoyed this. If you guys like me doing just little hauls like this on why I get stuff and what I make for dinner, um, I'm really bad about filming what I make because, like, full days of eating for me are hard because there's so much that go into it. I just don't want to film it all. I just want to make my food and eat. Um, maybe I'll get better at that uh, if I had, like, a bigger tripod or something. I don't know. Maybe if my husband starts filming for me or something. But um, I really love doing grocery hauls, and grocery hauls and letting you guys know what I get and why I get it. Because I get a lot of inspiration and ideas from other moms who do that. So if you like this, please give it a thumbs up. Go over to my Instagram account. I'm always asking you guys questions and for polls and stuff and what you guys want to see. Right now, um, it's already lapsed, but I'm going to be doing a YouTube video on... Um, just random questions like fitness, mom, funny, crazy, off the wall, whatever, um, day to day life stuff. Just ask me whatever. So go over. Um, I'm not going to do another poll, but I'll probably just like DM me a message or something with questions so I can um, do a YouTube video for you guys because I'd like to do a get to know me um, on my channel. I haven't really done that one yet. So yeah, um, thanks for watching, guys. I'm going to go put all this away. Love you. Bye. Love you.